Matt Main, Anthony Flesher. Um, this is a, a, a fight where Anthony's uh, kind of new. Um, I haven't seen too much of him, so I don't know what to expect from him. I know uh, his camp, and he comes from a tough camp. And Matt Main has fought um, in this Spokane circuit uh, quite a few times. He's, I've seen him up, I've seen him down. Um, he's kind of, to me, a guy that if you can get by him, um, you're ready for a higher level amateur fight. If you can't get by him, then um, you got a you got still a tough road ahead of you. The Flesher versus Main fight was a lot of subtleties. Kind of showed how mixed martial arts has really evolved on the lower circuits. The skill set that these guys are developing earlier on is actually quite impressive, and this fight's a good example of that with uh, submission defense displayed by one of the fighters. Flesher wearing the uh, black Jocko Spankies, and um, we got Matt Main. Anthony Flesher looks intense right now. He wants to brawl. Anthony Flesher wearing the uh, black Jocko Spankies, and um, we got Matt Main. Anthony Flesher looks intense right now. He wants to brawl. Oh, uh, no touch of gloves by Anthony Flesher. A nice double leg right to side control. I uh, notice uh, Matt Main's got the uh, tap out tattoo on there. Let's see if you can find a tap out in this fight. Now, when a fighter comes out with a lot of energy and excitement right off the bat, do you think that tends to help them or hurt them? Do you think you, you know, burn more energy getting all psyched up? Well, you know, I think it depends on uh, your opponent and, uh, you know, their skill set and, and what, what, you know, their game plan is. But uh, definitely sometimes it does really help fighters. How, you know, you can catch guys sleeping. Coming out hot. Okay. In oh, interesting scramble. What a move. He, uh... Nice switch, and he's attacking the RMC right away. And I, I think it's going to be over. Oh, nice. Pulls the tan. Good defense by Flesher. Pulling the hand off the top of the head. Not giving it up. Let me tell you, this is not a fun position, though, for uh, Anthony Flesher. He's really rep ripping on that. That man, he is sticking in there. He gives up on it. Anthony Flesher's, oh uh, man, staying tough, pulling it off the top, dude. Matt Main, I think, is going to get the finish here if he keeps working that close enough. Anthony just will not go well. He will not tap. Looks like it might be cinching a little bit tighter now. And there's a tap. And Matt Main was able just to stay consistent. Stay on flush with that RNC. I mean, you know, I see a lot of times in the pro level that uh, guys won't pull that top hand off the RNC. You know, that's the proper defense is pulling the hand off the RNC, you know, pulling the top hand off the RNC. And, and uh, Anthony Flesher, what, how many times have we seen him do it? You know, four or five times there and before he finally had to succumb to that submission. Matt Main stuck with it and got away with the victory. That was a beautiful hip switch that uh, he got there and reversed him. Great display of some skills there. And Matt Main does get the tap out. Yes, he does. 